Today I'm gonna show you how to make injera. We have our injera powder here. So we're gonna mix it with the water and then we'll put it for like three days and then we'll see the process. Well, be with us. Thank you. Okay, so for now, all we have to do is mix it with the water and then we have to give it time to fermentation. So we mix the uh, egg powder with the water, so we're gonna cover it and then at least we have to give it three days or maybe four and then I'm gonna show you the process. Good morning everyone, so our egg uh, is ready today. We fermented for like uh, four days, it's four days today. So what we're gonna do next is we're gonna have uh, uh, water, we'll boil it. Uh, and then uh, we have to add some amount of uh, fermented date to the boil water and then uh, we have to wait it there for like maybe 10 to 15 minutes and then uh, we will add it back here so I'll show you the state here's my mix the date my water is already boiled so Next time, I'm I'll, I'll gonna show you guys how amount, like how many cups you need to add. So our next step is to mix this again. We have to mix it well. So uh, what you're gonna do is after you mix this, it will gonna be a same color. Like you can't tell when it's mixed well. So, because it have actually a little bit different color, so you can see the difference after you mix it. So now it's ready. This is this is what it have, it have to look like. So mine is ready for now, and then after you do this, after you mix it, you have to wait at least for like a half hour. So we'll be back. How are you doing guys? So our injera is ready. So we need something to wipe our plate. Uh, and then it was really hard to find a cover for this plate, so I'll try this one. Uh, it's working for now. But look how this uh, comes perfect now. This is a real injera, Ethiopian and Eritrean injera. And uh, we have to cover it after we do this. We have to cover it because it doesn't need uh, air on it. If, uh, if there is uh, air on it, uh, it will gonna crack. So we need uh, some top on it. So, you see? So our injera is done now, uh, and you can see the color, everything. When it's done, you can pick it up. If it's not done, you can't, so you have to make sure that too. And then you need something like this, uh, easy to pick it up. 
in Ethiopia we have everything for itself, but here it's hard to get everything so I have to use whatever I, I had here. And then guys, you have to wait after you add the egg on the plate, you have to wait until, uh, I'm sure you can see these uh, small holes, you have to wait it, you have to give it some time to bring that holes, and then you have to cover it up. So we invite our families for dinner, for like Havishan dinner, so I'm cooking shiro and other stuff, that's why you are hearing this sound, sorry about that. <laughs> 